Okay, y'all. I did brush my hair a little bit, but not a lot. I went and put some water on it, or water, put some water on my face or whatever. Y'all gonna have to sell me flaws and all. But I wanted to come in here and talk to y'all about some shit that's been going on at work. Some shit that I got clarified yesterday because I know I'm not fucking stupid. And when some shit be going on, I sit back and I'll be like, oh, you know, what's going on? And I'll be like, oh, okay, this is what it is. And it always comes up. So, I got a new position at work, maybe like. January yeah January so I became like a RTA manager at work um <laughs> so when I became the RTA manager I started working with some other managers and there's this one lady wait let me start over I started working with some other managers, so it was it was two other people that came along with me, two new people that came to the position with me. Um, I was the only black guy. So then this black girl had came along after that, and she started working here or whatever, and I never had talked to her until the other day. So I had started noticing stuff, and I was like, I would say good morning in the chat room or whatever, first thing in the morning. I wouldn't get a response back. But the white people would post good morning, hello, and all this kind of stuff, and they start with having conversations. And I was like, maybe it's me. Maybe it's me or something. You know, I have a smart mouth sometimes. I tend to say certain stuff and stuff. And then I was like, so a little time went past. And I was like, wait, Tristan, you never actually said anything to these people. They don't work with you every day. They don't see you. They don't know what you actually think about them. So I was like, it's got to be in it. And the other guy, he's really, the other white guy, he's really, really, really nice. He's really friendly. He always talks. He'll check on you to see how you're doing and all this kind of stuff. And I said, okay, even if I don't like to use the word racist, I don't, I'm trying to retire that word, but sometimes it is what the fuck it is. It's, 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 it's crazy to think that people could still be racist in 2018. But in this situation, I believe this bitch, this oh, this my coworker, I believe that she is fucking racist because I come in, I'll say good morning, and then there's another guy, I believe he's racist as well. I'll come in and I'll speak. I'll say good morning. I don't get a response back. The only person who responds back is the the other the black girl. That's crazy. I've never done anything to you. The color of my skin should not matter to you what you think about me. We work together. How I see it about work, I don't give a fuck whether you black, blue, purple, red. I'm here to get green fucking dollars. And it's just ridiculous as to me as to... And I know it has to be that because I come in and I do my job every day the way I'm supposed to. And it's like... You can't sit here and tell me that... And if I was to say something about it, I probably, oh, you you know, it's not like that. I'm not fucking crazy, and I hate when people will play down on my fucking intelligence. So I said something to her about it the other day. I posted it, and I was like, why is it that when I say something or the other girl says something, you don't say anything back, but you'll say something back to the other two? She was like, oh, it's not like that. Uh... I never see you posting here. Bitch, you fucking lying. Because everybody that posts in here, you see it. You get a notification. It lights up on your screen the same, the same fucking way it lights up on my screen. Don't fucking play on my intelligence. Do not fucking do that. Because that's the wrong way to go about it. I will end you, bitch. Now. So she says, "Oh, it's not that. It's, it's it's not that." And I'm like, "So what is it then?" And she was she she so she sent me a private message because I call her out in front of everybody. I don't give a damn. I'm bold as fuck. And you know, it is what it is. If anybody got mad about it, it it's it's whatever. And I didn't take it personal. I just wanted to see what she was going to say, how she was going to defend herself. And so she sent me a message and was like. You know, it's not like that, and I'm sorry that you feel that way. I'm just always so busy or whatever, and, 
you know, sometimes I don't see everybody's chat. Back to my point that I was trying to make. You don't see everybody's message, but you make it a, a you make it a thing, a daily thing to have a conversation with the same people every day who happens to be not my skin color. And I'm not trying to make this a skin color thing, but that's just it is what it is in this situation. And it's not just me who noticed it. I just see things for what it is. I don't treat people. I don't treat people like that. I, I give everybody a fair opportunity. No matter what color you are. I come in here. I spread positive energy. Every day I come and I say hello. Everybody have a good day. I hope prosperous things happen to you today. That's just how I am. Anybody who knows me knows that's how I am. I talk a lot of shit. I talk a lot of trash. But at the end of the day, I want positive things to happen in everybody's life. I want to manifest that and speak positive things into everybody's life. So why can't you? And I know when people don't like me back, it has nothing to do with me. That's you. Because I've done nothing to you to create an issue with you. For you to dislike me for the color of my skin tone? Really? That's ridiculous. And I'm sure she's an old lady. She doesn't have a picture up here. So I don't even know. But I know she's... It's just like... It's just like, bitch, it's 2018. Get with the fucking program. I haven't done anything to you for you to treat me this way. I haven't done anything to you for you to act like this. We all got to come in here together and work together. And it would just seem to me that it would... I, I don't understand how people go to work every day and they have clicks or they have faves at work. Me personally, I do have the few that I like. But as far as I'm concerned at work, I don't fuck with none of y'all bitches. And that's just how it is. I don't fuck with none of y'all. I fuck with getting my check every two weeks. I came here to do my job. I fuck with getting my paycheck every two weeks. Y'all, I can give a fuck about. But it's like, if I speak, common courtesy should tell you to speak the fuck back. You saw teens should not act like that. You saw teens should not feel like that because I'm a fucking ginger snap. You shouldn't feel like that. That shit had me high. It's not that I'm upset about it. I'm upset about the situation in general. That people still have to go through that because of the color of their skin. Maybe the next gener generation will tune this shit out because this shit is fucking ridiculous. And I know she's older than me or whatever, but when I leave, because I'm going to apply to a new, a new position in like next month. And when that happens, I'm going to write a fucking letter about this bitch. And I'm going to say, you know what she... And you know... It's not even that, that she doesn't speak or whatever. I'll ask her something because she's been here. She's been here the longest. So I'll ask her something and like, oh, I need help with this. Can you help me out with this? I've only been here like a couple of months. So maybe something comes up that I don't know. And I'm honest. I'm transparent. If I don't know something, I'm not going to pretend like I don't know. So if somebody asks me something and I don't know, I'm going to be like, well, let me ask the next person who would know. So she'll answer like in a sarcastic way or in a smart way or like, I should already know this. You haven't told me this. I should. I, I shouldn't know this. Like the bitch gonna make me flip. And when I get upset, it's not pretty. But and I don't want to lose my job. But I can be very nice, nasty. And I'll read you in a certain way. I will shade the fuck out of you. I'll shade you today and you wouldn't even realize it until next week. Or you'll think about it and be like, you know what? That, I can't believe he said that. I will read you so down in a nice, nasty way. You won't even know what to say back. And that's just how it is. That's how I operate. When you come for me, and negative energy, I just don't like that. I have to shift stuff like that away from me because when you hold, when you hold stuff like that, it, it just deteriorates everything that I stand for. I don't want to get into it with this old ass bitch. I'm just saying that it sucks that racism still exists in the workplace. 
And I know everybody doesn't operate it. And maybe I'm looking too into it. Maybe I'm looking too deep into it. Maybe she just doesn't like me. Maybe, I, I don't know. Maybe she sees something different in the other two people. But I'm just seeing for what it is. Because me, she doesn't speak to me or the other black girl. So I'm just saying. Am I tripping? I really, I just want to know. And here he comes right now. He's here right now. He just logged in. And I bet you. She's going to say something back because she's here. I'm pretty sure she's going to say, and I've been here all day. She hasn't said a word to me since she got here today. A word to me. I bet you she's going to say something to him because he just said good afternoon, everybody. And I don't like him either because I just, I've never met any of these people that I work with because I, I do work from home. But I don't know what it is. It's like I can just instantly feel somebody's energy and people can feel my energy. You know, it's just the real connects with the real. Like even people will come up here and they'll be like, oh, Tristan, you seem cool or whatever. They never met me a day in my life. It is what it is. I see through people and their bullshit and for their works. I see people for their works. And I'm not getting ready to smile in your face or pretend like I like you because I don't. I'm never been good at being fake and I'm not about to act like that. But I just wanted to come in here and talk to you guys about that. Drop down in the comments and let me know if you guys have ever faced any racism in the workplace. Please let me know. I really want to know. Thank you guys. Bye.